Okay, hello. Welcome guys, welcome to my channel again. Thank you for always being around. Thank you for sticking around. Okay, so today um, I have um, a very important request among my comments that people are asking me to um, teach them how to create um, this, a simple and very short intro for uh, Prince Jam. So today I'm going, just going to teach you very simple and uh, short videos and uh, short uh, intro that you can use for all your Prince Jam. Now depending on the key you want to play, depending on what you want to do, depending on the song that you want to create. So I'm going to do on it on key C. So I will run the scale. C, C, D, E, D, E, B, C. So on key C. So now what I want to do now, it is actually very important for you to know that now if you are so very fortunate enough to know the song that you want to do and you know your chord progression, you know your chord family. What, what I mean by chord family, for example, now if you want to play your F, your chord family is F, A, C. These guys are together, they make four. One, two, three, four. The chord family for um, G, which is your chord five, is um, G, B, D. That is for sure. So for, so if you are so very fortunate for you to know um, the press you want to do, if you have it in mind, so then you can just see or uh, find a way around it, how to build your intro. But if you don't know what to play or if you don't know the press that you want to do before, you can just decide to just create something. So for example, now I'm just going to, you know this song, if you don't know this song, you may, you may, Jehovah, Jehovah, Jehovah. So that's just a song we're going to use, and I'm going to create different, um, different kind of intro for this song. So you will understand that it is not just that you should just try to create something, but you should under understand the chord family. Like I said, F E C. just understand what you want to do. So the chord for the Jehovah is Jehovah e four, oh, oh. and the chord family is e. that is the movement. E da da da. So one of the things that will also help you is when you know the movement of your chord, you can be able to build up something. So I will just start. So I have my loop here already. So, Jehovah, 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 Jehovah. So I want to create an intro now. This is something I don't even know. I just want to create something out of my own creativity. So I can just do something like this. One, two, three, go. So I did, I did. So 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 family do re mi la 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 ti 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 do. Jehovah, can you see? Very simple. So I can do another one. One, two, one, two, three, go. Do ti la so fa so do re mi do re mi. Sorry, sorry for that. I'll do it again. Do ti fa so fa so. Another intro. One, two, one, two, three, go. Sorry for that. Again. Saw me, saw me. So the idea is just for you to understand it's not about um sorry it's not about just copy copying what I did. The idea is for you to understand your chord, 
understand your court family, understand what you want to do, understand where you are going, understand the kind of um, the court progression you want to sing for your son. It will allow you to it will enlighten you to widen your horizon. You'll be able to understand that, okay, if I'm going to, for okay, let me do another song now. And our, another movement, let's say we have a... You know, the first one was... Fado, right? Fado, this one. La, 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 so, 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 right? So I will do the um, loop again. Now I'm trying to coop up an intro. Right? Okay, let me look for an intro. One, two, three, Very simple. One, two, three, go. Then you start your song. Very, very simple. So the basic thing number one is for you to understand your chord movement. Please don't skip this video and don't fast forward it so that you can get all the embellishment you can get all the things that i'll be saying please don't fast forward the video so that you can understand the concept behind this um this stuff so it's not just about um trying to copy my own uh, intro no try to be creative just understand your chord family and once you understand your tonic sofa which is your you can build anything i think anything on any particular key so this is just a few things i just said okay i was just share with you guys i'm still going to do another part but this is part one thank you for um trusting and believing so much in me thank you for subscribing and if you have not subscribed please i beg you please help me do that the lord bless you bye bye